so good afternoon class 6 today we are going to continue mock paper for half yearly exams so section c till section b we have done it is a subjective assessment very short answers first of all you will get that is of 2 marks five questions you have to do uh, carrying two marks each first is kindly raise your hand difference between threshing and sieving process yes tanishk and uh, one example you have also given to give uh, so the pro, uh, so first we will define the process of threshing the th in the threshing process um when we shake uh, the uh, uh, utensil the husk particles get separated from the grains uh, and sieving sieving Uh, we need a sieve for this uh, process of sieving um the uh, impure particles get separated through the sieve and the and the grains uh, um are left in the sieve and the example of threshing is an um mom we can say an the husk is separated from the grains yes, and in sieving you can say small pieces of stone can be separated uh, when yes, we yes. are uh, that uh, sieving the floor you may give when one yes. example of it so children you have to means two marks question is this so you have to write down two differences between threshing and sieving okay next b part explain how tap roots are different from uh this your fibrous root yes charvi tap root tap root is the main root of a of a plant is called tap and fibrous root is all all roots are similar are called fibrous roots okay fine it is yes uh, redhima can i have answer from your side even redhima ma'am c when ma'am c No, this one tap root and fibrous root. Ma'am, I know C one. C one. Answer of C. So tap root and uh, this you don't know tap root and fibrous root. What is the no, difference between two? Why, Saksham Sharma? Yes, tell me, Saksham. Yes, ma'am. Um, tap roots are the ma uh, main roots. It's called tap roots, and the fibrous roots are the, uh, fibrous roots are the. This is a bunch fibrous of roots. Fibrous roots. It is a bunch of bunch of our roots that is called the fibrous roots. That is near the base. Near the base, there are bunch of roots that is known as a fibrous root. And you can give the example: tap root is a carrot radish, and fibrous root is a grass. Okay. Next, let's move to the next question. Yes, Rayan Hazar. Yes, ma'am. C one na. Yes, read this question first of all. Ajesh was hit on his chest by a golf ball while playing cricket. He felt pain, but his heart and lungs were not injured. Why, ma'am? Uh, his heart and lungs were not injured because. it was protected by rib cage that's very why. good so heart and lungs are very delicate uh, organs but that is protected by rib cage very good next d part yes bhuvi why stem is a perfect example of two way traffic flow yes is a perfect example of two way traffic road because it is having branches on it and that no two stem you know the first work is done stem helps in conduction roots absorb water and through stem that water reaches to the leaves got it and second how it acts as a second way because the food prepared in the leaves that are sent to the uh, stem to the roots so in this way they are working as a two way traffic i think you have seen a two way traffic on the highways one side is for going and second side is for coming two way traffic goes on in the different so in this way 
सेम द स्टेम इज वर्किंग आदित्य विश्वास कैन यू एक्सप्लेन दिस क्वेश्चन नंबर डी पार्ट uh yes ma'am the why stem is a perfect example of two way traffic road uh ma'am because uh, uh, the stem provides a uh, uh, stem provides a food for for plant and uh, it goes to the roots and uh, again the means two way is there beta the water is absorbed by the roots that is sent to the leaves through the root through the stem and the food prepared in the leaves that is sent to the roots to the stem so means stem is doing the work of conduction so both ways one side is going up and other way is going down so in this I'm way not... yes got it got this answer or not still it is clear or not answer uh yes ma'am it is clear but ma'am can i explain what is a two way traffic road yes you can ma'am can you explain i don't know the answer two way traffic road you have not seen you must have seen on the highways one way is to go another way is to come uh yes ma'am i have seen you must have seen ek taraf aapne dekha hoga sari ki sari vehicles that move on a single side and from other side the all the vehicles come so two ways are there that is a two way traffic road okay that is on the highways you must have seen next e part is define solvent and solution so can, can i define define yes, solvent yes 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 a liquid that can dissolve with another uh, substance yes that is known as solvent and solution is a mixture of solute and solvent beta let me give you one example if i dissolve salt in water so water is a solvent got it everyone water is solvent and which is to be dissolved jisko hum dissolve karte hain that is known as solute so the mixture of solute and solvent is known as solution yes bhumika you have raised hand yes ma'am yes ma'am so i think this is clear yes beta yes ma'am can i the mixture formed by dissolving a solute in a solvent is called solution okay so solution is formed when solute and solvent mix together and i had given you example when we dissolve salt in water so water act as a solvent next short answer type questions 3 marks next is yes kanishka read this question while measuring the length unmute yourself beta unmute yes ma'am while measuring the length of of knitting needle the reading of the scale at one end is 4.6 cm and at the other end is 35.10 cm what is the length of the needle yes so you have to tell already this type of a question we have practiced in uh, worksheets so what can be the length of the needle reading of the scale at one end I'm is 4.6 and at the other end is 35.10 degree celsius So what can be yes charvi we have to add 4.6 and 35.10 and the answer is 39.7 39.16 cm 13.39 point how much cm it will be 7 yes okay fine 39.7 so children for getting the answer you have to add these two got it so your answer will be so you have to write in the small letters centimeter got it everyone Next. excuse me ma'am 
yes beta mam i think we have to subtract it with each other why so you have to subtract for this let's let's move to the next question discuss about how fish move so easily in water but humans can't ritul bhardwaj will you give the answer because fish fish has streamlined body that helps it to move in water very good because fish has a streamlined body and which reduces the friction and helps the fish to move in water very good number c part metals expand on heating explain with the help of an example hello start yes metal expands on heating just by the statement with suitable examples uh, when we heat the metal it gets expands so the example as we we are having a bottle and its cap is so tight so we are, we are not able to open it if we will heat the cap the cap will automatically gets loose and we, we will be able to uh, open it so it means when we heat something it gets expands and we can uh, use that or it gets expands yes very good best example is that even you people are doing this sometime when a metal cap becomes hard it's not opening so just put you just put it into the hot water and as soon as you put it into the hot water that expands and becomes loose very good best example tanish you want to give another example yes ma'am yes so ma'am metal expands on heating just with suitable examples so ma'am as we know there is a sub, uh, metal called gallium which is uh, which has um which don't has very strong um uh, shape and it melts very uh, fast but metal has very strong molecule uh, formation uh, so it ex uh, so it not easily expands on uh, on something when we heat it expands uh, okay. so it an example yes good beta so metal is expand on heating any of the example so many live examples are there it's not like that which is written in the book you that you have to go for and other examples you can also give let's move to the next one is there uh, any different features present in predators and prey living in the grassland habitat different features of predators and prey so children you have to write down predators you know grassland animals we have read about lion and deer so you can write down the features of that also okay and uh, long answer type question last any one you have to attempt that is of 5 marks write a short note on the types of plant and also give any two examples of each type types of plant so children this is of 5 marks so kindly write at least 5 like creepers climbers and what else shrubs trees excuse herbs me, yes excuse me ma'am please disable the chat someone is personal messaging me okay next is one more question is there write a short note on adaptation features of animals living in the following habitat so desert you can take off camel and aquatic any of the animal you can take okay. start in the desert even there are the camel camel have a one feature that 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 are time it's that that time that it's long amount of water and store in store in camel and after two and three years they do not have any required to water in and the aquatic region in the aquatic region they are have a face and the face have a feature is they have a streamlined body okay so the answer he has given that is not sufficient you can add more points in it like in the feature of desert desert animal if you are writing about at least you have to write down four or five points if you are writing about camel 
so can you give me the re, uh, answer for this part adaptation of camel yes ridhima tanya riyan azhar lakshindal ma'am can i hmm. ma'am can i one by one ma'am can i tell yes one has to tell beta continue start telling the adaptation they of camel excrete, they excrete small amount of heat they excrete small amount of urine heat nahi okay next yes ma'am any other camels can live camel for many days without day. water yes they can live without water for many days but next camel has to store water in their home camel has to in their home bam can i get from the land bam can yes reya nazar tell bam camel long legs so that they can protect from their body from heat yes so these are the adaptations you may write down the more adaptations about so with this children your uh, mock paper we have revised